Welcome and thanks for watching this Cast Highlight tutorial series. The main objective of this presentation is to walk you through our application portfolio analysis solution. Cast Highlight Welcome page provides a high level view on the health of the applications. In this example, our portfolio is composed of 168 apps that have been analyzed through several assessment campaigns. Key metrics are available directly from this screen, such as resiliency, agility, and software elegance on a scale of 1 to 100. Higher the score, healthier is the portfolio. Software resiliency indicates programming best practices that make the software bulletproof, more robust, and secure. Software agility indicates the easiness for a development team to understand, maintain, and change an application. Software elegance measures the ability to deliver software value with less code complexity. We can also leverage a cloud-ready index that measures the overall eligibility of applications to move to the cloud. Closer to 100, easier to migrate it's going to be. The Quick Portfolio Insights section enables to get lists of apps that matter. For instance, the most critical apps for the business, the ones that require the greatest maintenance effort, the most complex that might represent an important risk for a long-term perspective, and the applications that are the best candidate to migrate to the cloud. Let's drill down into some dashboards which strive to provide interesting correlation at portfolio level. This first dashboard displays the applications using three axes. The y-axis measures the business impact coming from the survey answers, where the x-axis represents the software resiliency coming from the source code analysis. The size of the bubble indicates the size in terms of lines of code. This integrated set of metrics allows to focus on key areas. First, let's focus on the business critical applications. Some are qualified as bulletproof software, but some others indicate a very low resiliency. In other words, a high likelihood of failure in production. These applications are usually very good candidates for reprioritization in order to mitigate the risk of failure, guarantee service continuity and uptime. We can switch the x-axis from resiliency to agility and get some other interesting insights. For instance, some apps that are quite critical for the business and suffer from a lack of agility. If we do correlate with the number of FTEs, we can observe that these two apps may be small. They require respectively 34 and 50 FTEs to work on the code. That's definitely a good example of some high-level insights that should trigger more in-depth investigations. At any stage of our navigation, we can easily add apps into our watch list to pursue more details analysis later on. To conclude, this configurable dashboard is meant to provide a key correlation abilities to analyze your assets and segment your portfolio accordingly. Use cases such as IT due diligence or IT rationalization are often great opportunities to identify and validate if our application portfolio does follow the enterprise standard guidelines. The code scan facilitates and speeds up the data collection, including the discovery of frameworks. This analysis allows to quickly inventory the technologies in use and consolidate the underlying health factors. This dashboard provides insights on the number of applications in use by technology. Then, for each programming language, we can get an objective measurement of the resiliency, agility, as well as software elegance. This transparency helps decision makers to promote and validate enterprise standards, validate any outsourcing strategy, or even expose any investment need to be made in the training of development teams. The application category dashboard is meant to correlate the business impact and the health with any given answers provided through the survey. In this specific case, the dashboard helps to identify overlapping or duplicate applications in order to reduce cost and complexity. Because Cast Highlight handles both cuts and custom apps, we can quickly compare all applications which provide the same services. In this specific example, we can spot a bunch of assets that provide capabilities into the space of content management and publishing, regardless if they are commercial or in-house developments. Into a rationalization approach, the next step should be to assess the opportunity to merge or retire some apps in order to cut costs and reduce complexity. 
As you can notice, Cast Highlight provides numerous dashboards to support decision making. Some of them are focusing on business impact, risk, portfolio demographics, frameworks, technical debt, and even on the software maintenance cost. This analysis consolidates the software maintenance effort. The bar chart compares the actual effort in black with an ideal effort estimate in yellow computed by the Kokomo 2 standard methodology. It enables to spot very quickly all the apps where the gap between the actual versus the recommended effort is high and then triggers the necessary actions to understand why. Ultimately, let's make sure that we optimize our resource allocation. Now, let's step back a little bit and use this insight into a digital transformation context. One of the primary drivers of digital transformation is to provide the best customer experience. Because software is everywhere, embracing digital transformation leads us to two important challenges that we have to overcome. First, building always more robust, scalable and intelligent software. Second, we find a way to design, develop, maintain and operate this software. In both challenges, the movement of applications to the cloud represents a key catalyst. In order to assist clients in this transition, we have added a new cloud-ready index as part of our analytics. This index appears at both the portfolio and application level. The intent is to measure the eligibility of applications to migrate to the cloud by leveraging correlations such as risk, costs, complexity, business impact, as well as technical roadblocks. The portfolio analysis leverages a dashboard which integrates the business impact with the overall readiness to move into the cloud. In a range of 1 to 100, the higher the score, the more ready the application is for the cloud. Some smart filters are available to guide your recommendations by identifying the applications that are eligible and not so critical for the business. These apps are usually perfect candidates to be part as the first wave of migration. Here is a second group of apps that have still a solid foundation to migrate but are clearly more critical for the business. They look perfect to build an internal success story. And let's be frank, you'll also face some challenges. In other words, we can also spot the applications that will require more effort to migrate and will need some modernization prior to ensure a seamless migration. As a complementary insight, Cast Highlight also enables cross-analysis between cloud readiness and health factors. It ends up with interesting correlations to spot assets that might be easy to move to the cloud, but on low scores regarding resiliency, agility, and elegance. As you can notice, the application portfolio analysis does offer a wide variety of metrics as well as cross-analysis to make sure you make informed decisions. When we click on one application, whether from the dashboard, a table, or even from the watch list, Cast Highlight moves from the portfolio dimension to focus on one single application's ID card. The application homepage displays high-level metrics on health factors, as well as cloud-ready index. Note that the ranking is provided to understand the positioning of the application amongst the entire portfolio. The several tabs provide additional details for this specific application. The survey, which inventories all the questions and associated answers captured during the assessment campaign. Please note that you can add as many custom questions in case you want to leverage a cast highlight workflow to capture additional details. The risk distribution shows how the risk is split by health factor and by technology. This assessment should lead us to a more detailed analysis through the code insight. We can glance at the top improvement opportunities by health factor and also by programming language. For any code alert, we can access to some details to understand why we should care and also what are the underlying recommendations. Although cast highlight is not meant to remediate the code per se, it provides the files where the alerts occur as well as the frequency. Please note that all these valuable insights can be exported in Excel to trigger actionable outcomes. The benchmark allows to compare the specific application with the rest of the application in your portfolio, but also against industry peers. 
This comparison can be done for any health factor and a drop-down list can be used to scope and filter the applications to be compared with. The framework section is a result of a discovery that happened during the source code scan. Cast Highlight can actually inventory the frameworks in use, capture their typology, as well as their associated versions. Here is another great example of findings that perfectly fit with a continuous assessment of both obsolescence and common vulnerabilities. Finally, there is the Cloud Ready section. This index is computed thanks to a survey and a scan of the application source code. The Cloud Ready survey computes a capital of points based on the provided survey answers. Then, we can transition to the rationale behind the Cloud Ready scan. The approach is quite similar to the health factors computation. In other words, the scan detects code patterns which are translated into either boosters or blockers. Regardless of their type, they are associated to a contribution which varies depending on their impact in terms of cloud requirements. The result of the Cloud Ready scan is then combined with the Cloud Ready survey to build the consolidated and final Cloud Ready index. Last but not least, the roadblocks represent the number of occurrence of these technical obstacles and the associated files. By fixing them, you increase your overall cloud readiness. Bear in mind that any single piece of data remains available. The application results dashboard provides advanced filtering features. We can actually execute our own segmentation rules, like for instance, the most resilient, agile and elegant software with the greatest Cloud Ready Index. Any single piece of information stored in Cast Highlight can then be exported using several formats like CSV, XML, and PowerPoint. And for your information, we also provide an API in case you want to leverage Cast Highlight metrics into a third-party tool. The PowerPoint report can be executed against the entire portfolio or on specific selected applications. They could have been identified thanks to advanced filters or simply added into the watch list along the analytics consumption. Usually, this actionable outcome is the ultimate foundation to build sound recommendations on your portfolio of applications. In order to manage the health of the portfolio over time and enable proactivity, the assessment must adapt to the life cycle of your apps. As soon as the application portfolio analysis becomes a continuous process, you can rapidly take benefits from the trends and therefore monitor your progress on key metrics like resiliency, agility, and cloud readiness. To sum up, Cast Highlight provides a rapid and objective portfolio analysis. The solution offers visibility into risk, cost, complexity, and business impact. This health assessment now includes the Cloud Ready Index to measure the eligibility of applications for cloud migration. Our ultimate objective? Provide application portfolio intelligence to enable smart decisions. Thanks for watching.